The key to the existence of the tiny sea creature at the heart of the Antarctic food chain has been unlocked. But global warming could see krill stocks plummet in coming years, along with all the creatures that depend on it. Krill is the staple diet of almost all Antarctic animals, from whales to penguins. But until now, exactly what the tiny shrimp-like creature eats to survive the long dark winter months has been a mystery. We do believe they are uh, especially the krill, especially the larval krill, the baby krills, heavily rely on the sea ice algae. That algae, the most nutritious food source available, grows on the underside of sea ice. But new research shows the main winter diet of the ocean's food source is under threat. Warming sea temperatures have led to increased levels of moisture in the atmosphere, which in turn creates more snow. A thicker snow cover would lead to a reduction in light penetrating through the sea ice and therefore the environment for the, for the algae to grow would be darker, which is probably not as good. Baby krill depend on algae to survive their first winter and to develop a layer of insulating fat. Sea ice algae is critical to the population. If they die in this winter, there's no baby krill coming into the population, the population will definitely drop. Given the Antarctic population's dependence on the tiny creature, the flow-on effects could be severe. If there's less krill, all the, all the animals who rely on krill, like whales, seals, penguins, will probably drop as well because they can't find the food. Professor Jia is exploring new ways to illustrate the impacts of the potential threat to the krill population. She says it's time for the world to rethink its appetite for krill. Jane Ryan, ABC News.